Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Dungeon Keeper 2. I've made a few more changes, hopefully it'll run a bit smoother. Um, I've kept pushed to talk of space because it's convenient, so let's get going. Ramshackle. This is a peaceful land, but a poor one, since its defender, Lord Avaricious, has frittered away his riches. If you can amass enough gold, he will surely be tempted into leaving his fortress and attacking you personally. Build a workshop, and fill your realm with fiendish traps and doors to protect your hard-won treasuries. Lure this fool to his doom, and claim his portal gem. Lord Avaricious hides within his fortress proud. He's well defended, but gold's his weakness. To lure him from his stronghold, mine all the gold within his realm. Treasury. Workshop. Sentry trap. Wooden door. This is another really easy level. Um, we're directed what to do, so it's going to be another uh, sort of quiet, trivial level, I think. But uh, we'll see. Recall. Your dungeon heart will only hold a sum of 16,000 gold, so build a treasury for the excess to amass. You oh, need good. a treasury to store gold. Let's make sure we have some um, walls in our dungeon heart. Although the enemies are so weak, they're not going to hurt us anyway. Ah, these are unlocked, that's good. Not a ready for bodybuilding library, to be honest. Probably a bit excessive, that room size there. Should be able to get a five by five in here, I'd have thought. One thing I noticed is when the mouse goes over the top of the screen is when it seems to really lag when I go along here. I'm not sure why, but but it seems to be the way. Hopefully it's not ruining the let's play. Probably the uh, dead air ruining the let's play, but that's what happens when there's not much to do. I could build my treasury. Uh, the swift light Firefly's essential as an airborne scout. His eyes are yours to penetrate dark places and report. Fireflies Your suck. require a place to rest. Build them a layer. So yeah, as I was saying, I could build a treasury. Um, but when you have a treasury, they keep going backwards and forwards to drop the gold off. Um, when you don't have a treasury, they just let it fall on the floor and get on with their job. So sometimes I don't bother building a treasury until I actually need to. And just let the gold fall on the floor. And there's no enemy imps to come around and steal it, so just let it drop. Fucking hate fireflies. Right, let's have a lair here. Um, they don't really need to be in a sensible space. And this way, a new right species of heart. creature has entered your dungeon. Same with treasuries, it doesn't matter what shape they are, so let's dump that here. Because there's no walls, there aren't any lights to light it up. But that's a right. workshop should be built, so trolls will come and use it for their fabrication. Benefiting you with traps and doors to help defend your underground creation. 
You cannot afford to build this room. Keep our gold in the dark so no one knows where it is. Especially our greedy creatures. In Dungeon Keeper 1 you got creatures called Demon Spawn and they're quite similar to Salamanders I guess is the nearest thing and if they got crossed they'd start smashing up your dungeon. They could smash up the walls for definite and they might have been able to smash up rooms as well. A troll arrives, attracted by the splendour of your workshop. His craftsman's skills are set to serve you well, as one whose toil will make both traps and doors for you to use in your defense. Tis well built. Now, choose the hammer tab to see the workshop panel, then select the symbol for the sentry trap. Place well your wooden doors in narrow tunnels to slow down hostile enemies as they invade. The tile which flashes near your dungeon heart is a good place as any for a sentry trap. You do not have enough gold. Trolls are some of the worst fighters in the game. I don't know if they're better than fireflies or not. They're at least useful because fireflies can't even do any chores around your dungeon. Um, but trolls are terrible fighters, they run away really quickly. Now watch. Your trolls will fabricate the trap, then imps will take it to its designated place. By A having wooden the door has been created in your workshop. Yeah, wooden doors are quite useless in terms of keeping enemies out, although the AI tends not to attack them. But they're very useful for locking your own creatures in rooms, so if you lock your creature in here, you can't go to the lair, you can't go to the hatchery, you can't go to the training room. But they get unhappy. There's so much gold in this level, if I remember correctly, that it doesn't matter, we can just chuck it at anything. Lots of wooden doors, for example. Your doors are locked with one left click upon them. Lock trolls within your workshop, then watch them work without distraction. Although in time, they'll yearn for sleep or food. Have a to be an lord avaricious from his stronghold, mine all the gold within his realm. A sentry trap has been created in your workshop. Of course, if you lock them in, the imps can't drag them back as well. That's also true. A wooden door has been created in your workshop. <laughs> These sentry traps will only fire if sufficient is your mana for their power. Yeah, they also create a drain on your mana. So you get mana for land. Um, normal land gives you one. I think walls count as well. And you also get special things called mana vaults, um, and they add 100 and take you over the 500 increase limit. They're quite rare though. If you have too many imps then the game used to crash, but um, this patch GOG version seems to be as stable as it was when it was released, more if anything. So I'm not going to worry about having too many imps. You start getting extra sayings when you have 20 imps. The um, announcer sometimes just makes noise for the sake of it and says silly things. Some of them are quite funny. Um, when you get 20 imps, he, he starts saying extra um, comments about the imps. But I'll leave him to tell you those himself. Oh. 
A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. I see you have discovered a magical item. If I hadn't locked my library up, they'd be allowed to take that to the library. So let's do that. So let's get 15 spaces in here. Oh, that's him. That's the boss of the level. That's not good. The entire world has been revealed to you. Let's have a look, see if we can see any secrets. I don't think I did miss a secret at all. Um, I actually cheated and looked online to see where the secret levels are, and that wasn't one in level two. has become unhappy because he has no lair. Your creatures are unable to get your treasuries. This is why I like to split it into happiness, so we know this guy here is going to have to go to a lair next. And he's got his money. Why is he unhappy? Food. some more land out or get some more mana so let's do that oh the sentry trap will it win looks like eventually it will actually these guys suck. Um, you get an equivalent later on called the Rogue. They suck as well, really. But they're quite neat in that our units can go invisible if we possess them. So you can walk around the dungeons uh, of your enemies and they think it's they think your character is them. Um, I think that's how it works anyway. A troll has become unhappy because he has no food.
Your dungeon heart is under attack. I never realized sentry traps were so good, actually. I know these are all level one, but he managed to kill three battles. Tron has become unhappy because he has no food. Your creatures are unable to get well. Where's our level four? I'm sure we had a level four. Where's he gone? Maybe I'm just going mad. A warlock has become unhappy because he has no food. This is pretty intensive training. They're all going to get pissed off in the head. A goblin has become unhappy because he has no food. Right, let's kill some of these then. A troll has become unhappy because he has no food. I don't know if this guy can kill them on his own. No, he's level 4 as well, isn't he? If we actually fucking do something. Okay, well that was a failure. But we're probably strong enough to uh, kill everyone now, so let's let us heal up. And we'll get him to come to our dungeon. I could even build some more sentry traps, but let, I, can, I reckon we can kill him out here. We'll build some sentry traps here, I guess. A warlock has become unhappy because he hasn't been paid. There's no real chance of us losing, I don't think. Even if we got um, our asses kicked, the enemy isn't going to come and attack us, so we can just wait until there's a hole in the dungeon he has no food. You can drop gold onto creatures, even if it's not payday and it'll make them happy. So if you get an unhappy creature, you can try just throwing gold at it. I don't think we like any of our creatures enough to care, really. Claim every tile around the hero gate, like this one, it'll collapse. Um, you can place bridges around them if they're in water, and that'll collapse them as well. So You've claimed the land more, around um, the hero gate, and that's broken it. No more thieving heroes will invade your realm this way. You've taken over an enemy room. No, I completely forgot how good sentry traps were. A wooden door has been created in your workshop. 
A sentry trap has been created in your workshop. So much mana in it, we could probably just kill him with electricity. I think it's only level one still. Yeah, these levels really are easy. If there's a mod out there that makes them harder, that'd be interesting. Oh, the fucker's attacking now. Let's just go for him. Your destiny is to die by my sword. One of your imps does a great impression of you. He can even do years. You thieving keeper! I will punish you for daring to despoil my land! the noble whatever will you think of next keeper the sunlit kingdom of the heroes draws a little closer with each victory and this was cleverly fought well done lord avaricious lies broken before you with his gold in your coffers who says you can't buy happiness sorry for skipping the ending um Maybe I should remap this button after all. I feel really stupid now, especially after acknowledging it last level. And then I did it anyway, so that was dumb. However, let's go on. We'll improve for level four. <laughs>